The main purpose of core drilling is to retrieve a high-quality core sample. To understand the core drilling process, we will start with the different components of the equipment. Let's take a look at the drill string. A ring-shaped drill bit is armed with diamonds or tungsten carbide and cuts the core sample out of the rock or soil. The drill bit is mounted on a reaming shell, also armed with diamonds or tungsten carbide, which reams the drill hole to the right diameter and stabilizes the bit. The reaming shell is mounted on a core barrel, whose purpose is to collect the core sample. Inside the core barrel is a non-rotating inner tube, which stores the core sample during drilling. A number of drill rods connect the core barrel with the drill rig. Their main purpose is to transfer torque, rotation speed, feed, and lifting force from the drill rig to the drill bit. When drilling in non-stable formations, casing tubes are needed to prevent the hole from caving in. A flushing system flushes the drilling fluid through the drill string. The core drilling process includes three major operations. The actual drilling, the retrieving of the core sample, and resuming of the drilling. Together, this is called a round trip. And for each round trip, the drill hole is extended by the length of one or two drill rods.